Well, as you can see, the range is really overgrown. <laughs> oh man, I haven't been down here in probably since my last uh, concealed carry class back in June. So it's been over a month, a couple days over a month anyway. You know, I was out of town. I usually don't go this far. I don't have to go this long without shooting. So I needed to come down to get some range there every day, and as you can tell. I mean, I was doing a little moving and shooting. And, uh, but it, it still doesn't take a fact away that it's fucking hot down here today. Of course, it is the end of July. We're at the hard, hottest part of our, our year for North Carolina. Start cooling down in about five weeks, another month or so, and, uh, it is really overgrown. But I got my range therapy in, and I've had this, uh, ammo that I've used for my concealed carry my defensive ammo for a while so I went ahead and burned that up because I'm actually switching out brands and uh, going with some fresh rounds Just adjust myself here because after uh, it was dare I say probably a little past the time where I'm uh, comfortable keeping it around you know, they shot fine, but, you know, the bullets were getting tarnished, and I've had those rounds for, and that weapon for a while, and it was just time to, time to switch it out for some fresh stuff. <sighs> so I'm going to, uh, what I was carrying was 147 green plus P Winchester, the Ranger round, the SXT. And uh, I'm actually switching over to the Spear G2 147 grain uh, round that is now the official duty issue for the uh, FBI. Mm. Switching again. Oh man. So, yeah, that's the round they're officially carrying for duty since they switched out of 40, went back to 9mm. It's an incredible round. The biggest advantage of using that particular round is this current issue, you know, um, something to think about, guys, is, you know, being being careful with the type of rounds you carry and you know I chose that round because it's now a common round <clears throat> that is used by law enforcement and I still stress this while it's an awesome novelty and it's cool just to have if you want to collect it avoid stuff it and like I said I've said it before I love Hornaday but avoid avoid that zombie Z Max ammo for your defensive round you know, it's okay to have some around your house, but, you know, courts have a way of using that against you. Just like the police officer who got charged with murder because he had to use this AR, police issue M4, on someone, and he switched out the uh, bolt cover plate that, once it opens, it says you're fucked on it. It's just, it shows too much intent. It shows too much mindset. And remember, we're not here, out here to shoot to kill. We're out here to shoot to stop the threat. So, if the FBI has deemed the G2 round is the best round for them to stop any shooting, you know, lethal threats, then that's the round I'm gonna use. Now, check with your local law enforcement. See what round they're using. <clears throat> you know? A lot of cops are gun guys, a lot are not, but a lot of them are gun guys, they'll tell you. Use that round. You know? Just a tip, something to think about. Anyway, I got this big ass hill to climb. That goes up around the bend, so let's do it. Anyway guys, get out there, train. Make sure you hydrate. Especially hot days. Just get after it. <laughs>